What's up guys, Kevin DeBruin, the fit rocket scientist here today to teach you about the sun, that big bright thing in the sky that we see out there. That's one of the things that allows us to live here on earth, to have life. So the sun, it's about 93 million miles away or about 150 million kilometers and it's beautiful. It's out there, it's bright, you can't look at it without hurting your eyes. So we're going to learn a little bit more about it today. And in doing so, I made a nice little graphic here we're going to walk through. Look at this. I am a nice artist. This is beautiful. I like it. So we're going to start with the three inner layers of the sun. The innermost layer, here number one is blue, is the core. The core. So as you go closer into the sun, it's the hottest in the middle. The core is the hottest part of the inner layers of the sun. Now, number two. Number two is the radiated zone. It covers a large portion of the outside of the core moving towards the outside. And then number three is the convection zone. It is the outermost layer of the inner layers of the sun, but not quite to the surface yet. So we got one, two, three for our inner layers, core, radiative zone, and convection zone. All right, so then we get right to the outer surface of the sun. So the surface is, is really tiny compared to these. So we got it broken out here, four, five, and six. So the first one here is the photosphere. So that's what we can actually see. That is the surface of the sun that we observe like, with our eyes. When you take a look at it, the photosphere. Photo, view, you know, kind of cool. All right, we move on to number five, which is the chromosphere, which covers a lot of the, the outermost layer. It actually gets hotter as you go through these outer layers. It gets hotter. Five is hotter than four, six is hotter than five. It's kind of strange. It's like a medium point. It gets hotter as you go in, and then hotter as you go up. So photosphere, chromosphere, and then the sixth one is the corona. This is the hottest part on the outside of the sun. Um, it's big, beautiful, and ejects stuff. So then we see other things on the sun. We've got solar flares, this white part here. Um, so it is solar flares are actually ejecting x-rays and energy at light speed towards Earth um, and towards the rest of the, the solar system. And then we have sunspots. So they appear black on a lot of pictures, but they're not black. The reason they appear black is because they're just not as hot as the surrounding area. So it's just less extremely hot here, super extremely hot here. And then we have this CME. So this is a big old giant cloud of particles. CME is coronal, because we're in the corona now, mass ejection. So it's a mass ejection of a giant cloud of particles that get spit off. So sometimes the CMEs and the solar flares happen at the same time. They can be uh, part of the same event. Sometimes they happen independent of each other, and they both affect Earth in different ways. But so we have three layers of the inner sun, the core, the radiative zone, and the convection zone, and then the three outer layers are the photosphere, the chromosphere, and the corona. And then on the outside of the corona, we can have solar flares, sunspots, and CMEs. So I'll put this down. You can see here we've got some sunspots. They're a little bit darker here. And if we squirt a little bit more, we've got our solar flares right here, the white that would be coming off. Don't have really coronal mass ejections. Maybe you can see some of those with maybe one of these is chrome mass ejection. But that's what we have with the sun. So we have three inner layers, it gets hotter as you go in, three outer layers, it gets hotter as you go away, and it's just this big beautiful thing that allows us to live here on Earth. It's what causes plants to have photosynthesis. It's one of the main ingredients that we look for for a habitable planet out around other stars. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Click the thumbs up, click the like button, subscribe, comment, share it with your friends. Hope you all have a great day.